I may have an idea here. I'm just thinking out loud now, but it seems to me that it's up to us to convince this gentleman that we're right and he's wrong. Maybe if we each took a minute or two, you know, tried on for socks. Okay, let's start it off. Oh, well, I think he's guilty. I thought it was obvious, but nobody proved otherwise. Nobody has to prove otherwise. The burden of proof is on the prosecution. The defendant doesn't have to open his mouth. That's in the Constitution, the Fifth Amendment. You've heard of it. Well, sure, I've heard of it. I know what it is. I, what I meant. Well, anyway, I think he was guilty. Okay, let's get to the facts. Number one, let's take the old man who lived on the second floor right underneath the room where the murder took place. At 10 minutes after 12 on the night of the killing, he heard loud noises in the upstairs apartment. He said it sounded like a fight. Then he heard the kid say to his father, I'm gonna kill you. A second later, he heard a body falling, and he ran to the door of his apartment, looked out, and saw the kid running down the stairs and out of the house. Then he called the police. They found the father with a knife in his chest. And the coroner fixed the time of death at around midnight. Now what else do you want? The boy's entire story is flimsy. He claimed he was at the movies. That's a little ridiculous, isn't it? He couldn't even remember what pictures he saw. That's right. Did you hear that? You're absolutely right. That's right. She saw the killing, didn't she? Just a minute. Here's a woman who's lying in bed and can't sleep. It's hot out, you know. Anyway, she looks at the window and right across the street, she sees a kid stick the knife into his father. She's known the kid all his life. His window is right opposite of hers. Across the tracks, she swore she saw him do it. Through the windows of a passing elevated train? Okay, and they proved the court that you can look right through the windows of the passing train at night and see what's happening on the other side. They proved it. 